Now, sometimes uh, we are not able to achieve the target doses of RNA. And question is whether RNA in any dose is effective or not. So these are two important questions which need to be answered. So let's look at the first point. Why is it that some of the patients are not able to achieve the doses of sacubitril valsartan? The commonest cause is symptomatic hypotension. All those patients who could not to uh, uh, tolerate proper doses of sacubitril valsartan or those who could not tolerate increase in doses, most of these patients had symptomatic hypotension. Now, let me uh, assure you that first of all, the percentage of patients who cannot achieve, cannot take any dose of RNA are very few. I would say 95% of your patients will be able to tolerate some dose of RNA. But out of those patients, most of those where you had to stop RNA would be those patients where they had symptomatic hypotension. Hyperkalemia, of course, is, uh, is another problem. But there, if you look at the renal function and start uh, properly, then that should not be a problem. Gastrointestinal symptoms are pretty rare. And worsened GFR is also quite rare. So most of those patients where you can't achieve proper doses is probably because of uh, symptomatic hypotension. Now, how do we treat this symptomatic hypotension? We have seen that on RV, once you reduce the diuretics, which are not necessary generally, you are able to achieve proper doses. Secondly, drugs like nitrates, calcium channel blockers should be stopped. They, they, they have no role to play in heart failure uh, when there is hypotension. So the moment you stop, those patients where you could not start, now you will be able to start. So you will be left with only one or two percent of patients where you will not be able to give any dose of RNA because of hypotension. Another thing, the sacubitril valsartan, when started at 50 milligrams BD, 100 milligrams BD, 200 milligrams BD, all these doses, including 50 milligrams BD, which is a low dose, are known to benefit patients. So for some reason, if you are unable to increase the RNA dose, be happy that if you are able to give even 50 milligrams BD, your patient will get more benefits than from ACE ARVs. So don't get disheartened if you are not able to start the full dose of ARVs.